Hi friends, Nins here. Thank you for tuning in to another one of my videos. As I have announced before, I worked on a number of paintings for an exhibit that I opened last December 9, 2022. I was not able to take time-lapse videos of my work, but I am going to share the story behind this collection of paintings. The title of the exhibit is Passage and it is a short story told through eight paintings of a girl whose wings change colors as she passes through different doors, chapters, and environments. The word passage is defined as the act or process of moving through, under, over, or past something on the way from one place to another. It is also the process of transition from one state to another, and it also means a short extract from a book. Each definition describes this collection of excerpts of the girl's journey through different times of day. It shows how she grows and how her wings change colors as she passes through. These paintings tell a story inspired by some musings and realizations from the artist's or my personal life that spring from a combination of seasons or chapters of darkness, discouragement, and loss of faith, as well as growth, hope, grace, and how the light finds her. Let me read you that story. In the middle of the room stood a cloth-bound book, slightly beaten and worn. It belonged to a girl with wings painted by the sky, colors of dusk and dawn. She walked up to the book, flipped through the pages, and her mind began to fly. Back to the day she walked through sunlight and shadow, and her quiet conversations with the light. Some pages were inked like a dark night sky, empty, with her wings too tired for flight. Overwhelmed, she felt the darkness try to drown her and make her want to give up the fight. But I am with you, said a still small voice, a sliver of light in the night. The girl found comfort in the presence of the moon, who sang of hope in the dead of the night. Still surrounded by darkness, she persevered, kept her eyes fixed, and built her home with the gentle moonlight. As the moon continued to speak of hope, reminding her of the light of day, the girl slowly but surely began to grow and viewed past and present stories a whole new way. There were doors she passed through time and time again that led to hurt and cold rain. They left her feeling beaten and blue, but in the light of growth, the rain glowed gold through the pain. As she continued on her journey through different doors and chapters and ways, she began to see her wings capture color as she moved through the night, looking to the day. Dawn will come, she whispered constantly to herself, the moon's light a promise of this truth. She imagines warmth from the sun on her skin and feathers, full light painting her wings to match Dawn's hue. It will, it will, it will, hope promises it will be so. Our story continues, more chapters and doors await. What do we do till the next dawn? We hope and we grow. 
Until then, we can stand and look back at our journey like the girl with her cloth-bound book. Wings painted from colors of growth in both light and darkness. My friend, it's a beautiful look. So there you have it friends, that was the short story behind this collection of paintings for my exhibit entitled Passage. If you're in Bacolod City, Philippines and would like to see these paintings in person, you can visit Artful Gallery along Laxon Street. The exhibit will run until January 9, 2023. From the bottom of my heart, thank you again for listening to my short story. I hope it encouraged you to keep growing and keep hoping. So till the next one, take care and goodbye.